Uh, what's up, Broadway.com? Episode number five, I think? I don't know, I never know. But, magic to do, I'm here with a bunch of the Broadway people who ride the train in! This is amazing. Okay, guys, how's everyone here? We got Come From Away, we got Tootsie. Tootsie! Said. All right, guys, so, um, all right, we're kicking it off at Platform 9 and and platform 07052. <laughs> uh, all right. Magic to do. Get ready. You guys, it's time, time, time. Four, four, four. Bean, 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 boozle, zoozle, zoozle, zo, zo. That was terrible. Well, I thought that was pretty good. No, I okay. no, was it reacting was, to was on yeah, the Okay. There you go. Well, no, what this what might be. What is this or what is this? That's canned dog food or uh, chocolate pudding. Okay. And Derek? Hi, ready? Okay. What do you use? What's yours? Uh, I don't know. Peach Rachel? or barf. Peach, Peach or, or barf. barf. Oh, I got barf last time. One. Oh, great. Two. Three. Three. Do it! Is it weird that I can't tell whether it's canned dog no, food or chocolate? No, it's canned dog weird. food. Get it, you gotta spit Go. it out. Yeah, you gotta spit, spit it out in the hallway. It smells too bad. Mine's peach. <laughs> oh, oh, you are a peach. I still can't tell. Yeah, can't you smell it? No. Can you smell yeah. it? Excuse me. Do, would you I'm gonna go throw up. So I did Bean Boozled about, oh, over an hour ago. My breath still smells like canned dog food. Just want to let you know that. Yeah. 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 Crouching Potter. Hidden dad joke. Read this. How does Darth Vader know what Luke got him for Christmas? He felt his presence. Dad joke. Pew, pew, pew! Well, everyone, welcome to Between Two Shows with James Snyder and Lauren Cipolletti. That's right. Sips. Well, oh, what is your handle? At, uh, at Sips. C-I-P-P-S, right? Ah. Yeah. Yes. It's awesome. I like your hat. Thank you. Are you indeed awesome. muggle-born? Yes. She is. But here in the wizarding world, you do lots of roles, but I think the big standout, the one that everyone loves, is Moaning Myrtle. What? What is your favorite thing about what you get to do on stage, in particular, Moaning Myrtle? Um, as Moaning Myrtle, yeah. uh, I'm really proud of myself for learning how to master that sync, because they showed me that the first time, because yeah. I didn't know what she was going to do when I auditioned. Yeah, yeah. I thought she flew or something, so when I auditioned, like, a ghost, I just like, she's a yeah. ghost. Basically, if you haven't read the books, Moaning Myrtle is this ghost who lives in the... The, um, the pipes and the... Most importantly, the uh, girls' bathroom on the first floor. Um, yeah. Yeah, but I, I, they showed it to me, or Stephen Hoggett showed it to me, and I was like, what is that? It's a very physical, it's like borderline gymnastics yeah. that, that you have to do. It's, it's a sink, it's a device. We can't, I don't even know if we could show you or describe it, hashtag keep the secrets, but. It's in it's, the photo. It's in the photo, <laughs> yeah, she's spinning all over the place and blah, blah, blah. It's crazy. And then, like, uh, how much of the books did you read? Like, did you, when um, you booked the part, like... I read all the books when I was a kid, like, yeah. over and over and over again. Oh, um, oh, wow. Oh, so you, yeah, yeah nice. Yeah, so, but, um, and then when I got the part, I, I read a few of them and then kind of wanted to discover everything in a new way. Mm -hmm. And just wanted to rely on, like, my, um own experience of them from before and and then I read of course like the books that had her in it mm -hmm. um, and then I yeah. watched all the during the audition process I watched all the films yeah and then um, I haven't yeah. watched the films again I watched the no. first one yeah that was yeah. it yeah since just mostly to see if Oliver could handle it oh um what was it like revisiting it as a grown-up versus a kid it was cool I mean I think the movies ended in what 2000 like 10, 11 years long, ago. A very long time ago. Um, yeah. And I never thought that I would get the chance to be a part of the, the wizarding world. Yeah. So when this came out, I was like, this is my chance. This is my chance to live the dream that I wanted to do as a child. And then I was lucky enough to get it. Yeah. You're so great in the show and as a person. Thanks. It's... Um, Thank you very much. We, it really is like a great little family. Yeah. And it's nice. And you fit really well. And you, you made us feel really welcome. Yeah. Those of us that were scared to death yeah. to be entering into this whole crazy show. Well, I think, and the, and the positive of the rehearsal process, of the redoing the rehearsal yeah. process, is that 
it was so cool to watch everybody discover their own new versions yeah. of these characters that I uh, specifically had grown so accustomed to <laughs> what I had been seeing every day. And so it was really cool to see that the script holds up and that everybody can take it and make it their own, and it's still... Yeah, we for the like first because right. we uh, we didn't get to work together as much. It was like that uh, we were still finding comedy. It took like a month, I feel like, to nail down the some of like the foot thing and stuff. Like, oh yeah, yeah, right? we were talking about like, it all the time. But I think we've got it. I think yeah, this is yeah. it, right? This is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All that's right. Cool. Well, to see what we're talking about, come see the show, uh, Harry Potter and, uh, the, and the Cursed Child's Child. Part One and Two. As if you don't already know that because you're watching Magic to Do. Um, but Lauren, you're awesome. If you ever feel useless, just remember that the Minions movies have subtitles. Level G! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> when Accio goes wrong. Accio glasses? Wait, how am I supposed to see them to catch them? I didn't really think this one through, did I? Next time. It's time for... Mediocre Moments in Magic! Music Keep going! Keep going! That's impressive. That's actually really good. That's impressive. Ah, maybe uh, maybe I need to upgrade from mediocre to like not so mediocre Moments in Magic. What do you guys think? All right, so I think we're gonna finish uh, this episode here at the line at Harry Potter. Did you guys have a good time? Yeah! Okay, everyone, give me a one. Your favorite spell on three. One, two, three. Yeah! That was magical, everyone. We had magic to do. Okay, it's been a very long week. I'm ready for bed. Um, and, and I'm gonna sign and say goodbye to these people. I'm gonna say goodbye to you people. Magic to do. I'll see you guys next week.